Hello and welcome everyone. My name is Omar from Detective Shop Company in Dubai. We authorize agents in Dubai and Middle East to sell all detecting devices that can detect gold, metals, and underground water. Today we're going to present you one of the best 3D ground scanner, UIG ground scanner from GR Detect Factory. It works with the three stair system, the wall live scan system, ground live scan system, and the 3D imaging system, with a depth that can reach 30 meters. And now we'll talk more about the accessories of the device. First, we have the warranty here, five years from our company, and the CD training, plus here we have the tablet and the tablet holder, and here we have the imaging sensor, the tablet case, the grip of the device, with a click here you can take the picture, pictures with it, and also we have here the sensor and the arm of the imaging sensor. Now here we have the battery, 2,500 milliampere, plus we have the charging accessories with two cables, and we have finally the carrying bag. And now we'll see in the next video how we use the UIG ground scanner. And now we'll see together first how we install the scanner. First, we have the arm of the device and we have the sensor. Now we're going to connect them both together and we're going to screw this in here. And now we have the grip of the device. We're going to slide it just like that. And finally, we're going to attach the battery from this side. And we're going to turn on the battery by pressing for two seconds to, to enable the device to connect to the tablet. And now we'll show you guys the setting and how we use the UIG ground scanner. And now we'll press on the UIG ground scanner app. And then we're going to wait until the device is connecting. We'll press connect again. And we're going to confirm it by pressing OK. And then we will see all the systems. And here we can save our, our work. And we'll go now to the setting. Here we have all the languages. We have six international language. And we have the sound, the vibration, and the capture button. So we will choose English. We'll go back. And here we have the file that we already saved. And then we will start with the ground live system. Now we'll press start and the device is calibrating. Now first we use this, this system to detect for live scan of treasures, gold, voids and all type of metals. Now we explain the icons here. We should always keep the dot inside the circles. Here we have the calibration button and the mute and unmute for the sound and also here we have the values and the time in seconds. Now we have the blue color and the red color here, the blue for voids and the red and metals. And now we'll show you guys how we use the ground life scan system. And now we'll show you guys how we use the ground life scan system. First we're going to adjust the height of the arm of the imaging sensor about 5 to 10 centimeters above the ground and now we can walk with the device and see the signals here. And if we're going to rotate, we always should uh, rotate in this way. And we should avoid always walking in this way. Now we'll explain the colors. The red for metals, the blue for cavities, and the green for normal soil, and the orange and yellow for mineralized soil. After that, we'll, we'll see, guys, how we use the wall life scan system. And now we will choose the wall life scan system. Here is a tutorial on how we use the device. Then we're going to click the start button and here is the calibrating of the device. Now here we have the circle, we always should keep it in the middle. Also the calibration button and the mute and unmute for the device. Also we have the red for metals and the blue for cavities. Now here we have the time in seconds and the values as well. Now for the colors, the green for normal soil, and the red for metals, and the blue for cavities. And now we'll show you guys on the wall how we use the wall life scan system. Now we're going to hold the device, and we're going to calibrate the device now. And second, we're going to keep the sensor about 5 to 10 centimeters. And now we can start scanning by moving the device up and down. And we can move the device to the left. Also, we can scan between each line 
and keep the sensor in between them. Also, we can see the reading now. If we have the blue color, that means we have cavities. If we have red, that means we have metals. And if we have also the, the green. And now we'll show you guys the last system, which is the 3D imaging system. Now we're going to click here. And here we have to choose our dimension. We have the lines and we have the steps, which is in each line. Now we're going to press next. And here we have to choose our soil tap. It's a very important step in order to find the right depth. So we're going to choose normal, for example. And here we have to choose our search direction. So we have the zigzag and we have the pearl. We will choose pearl. And now the device is calibrating and we'll show you guys how we use the 3D imaging system. Now we'll show you guys how we use the 3D imaging system. First, we're going to keep the device on the right side of us and leave the sensor about 5 to 10 centimeters above the ground. And we should always start from left to right. Now we'll start scanning. And we're going to press trigger on each step we're taking. Also, we have an option to press on the screen here. After that, we're going to take a step to the right. And now we'll show you guys the analysis here in the picture. So here we have the grid lines, so we can see the picture more clear. Also here we can see the percentage of each color. Now the red for metals, here we have the yellow for mineralized soil. Also here we have the green for normal soil and the light blue for rocks. And here we have the blue for cavities and voids. Now we'll go here for the possible targets where the device give us in meters and centimeters and here we can increase and decrease the contrast in the color also here we have the values now the values if it's between a 20 value range between each color that means we have a real target if we have more than that that means we have a false target after that now we go to the layers option so we can see here the pictures in layers and also in this option we can separate the layers so we can see the metals separately and we can see the cavities separately as well. Also we can decrease and, and increase the height here in the picture so we can see the target more accurately and also we can see here a different views that's supported by the device. And we can see here the possible targets. And finally, we'll go now to the 3D option. So this is a 3D option where we can see the picture in 3D. So we can here take off the grid line and we can put it on. Also, we can increase and decrease the height here. Also, we have the streamline gradient icon. And we have the sharp gradient icon which give us the device in a sharp shapes. And here we have the Quebec icon. UIG ground scanner is now available in our company, Detector Shop in Dubai. We provide you free training, shipping to our countries, and five years of warranty. To order the device or more information, contact us. Thank you for watching.